up if you've brought products from TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and Marshalls. They have to pay millions of dollars in fines because they keep selling recall products, mainly infant, uh, like uh, the cradles, the little sitting chairs, um, all kind of stuff. So definitely want to listen to this story um, because you may be able to take it and get your money back. Okay, so listen up to it. Huge fine for the parent company of discount retailers, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and Home Goods. The store is ordered to pay millions for knowingly selling recall products, including infant sleepers with proven risks of death. Ariel Reshef is here with more. Good morning, Ariel. Hey, good morning to you, Michael. As you know, these stores are known for selling a wide variety of products and home goods at deep discounts, which makes them appealing. But this morning, the Consumer Product Safety Commission says TJX stores knowingly sold, offered for sale, and distributed approximately 1,200 recalled products. Now the company will pay a $13 million fine. The majority of those items sold wrist infant suffocation and death, as you mentioned. They include the Kids 2 Rocking Sleepers, Fisher Price Rock and Play Sleepers and Fisher Price Incline Sleeper Accessory for ultralight day and night play yards. TJX telling ABC News product safety is very important to us and we prohibit the sale of recalled items in our stores. We deeply regret that in some instances between 2014 and 2019 recalled products were not properly removed from our sales floors despite the recall processes that we had in place. The Consumer Product Safety Commission says if you may have bought one of these recalled items you can contact the store where you did so or the manufacturer for a refund, but it's a good reminder that you should do some diligence when it comes to those baby products.